Chiggy, did you get something new? <laughs> what'd you get, Chiggy? Chiggy, what'd you get? <laughs> you guys might know that we reviewed the, um, the Pet Fit for Life 3-in-1 cat wand toy and the little squiggly worm that we were sent started falling apart and so they sent these replacements and <laughs> I just pulled them out of the little bag and Chiggy started meowing as soon as I pulled them out so then I pulled out my phone to take video of him. We make it go. You miss your wand toys? I'll play with it with him later. We we're about to go outside so. <laughs> get that done first. All right, so here is the one that we used during the review and this is how it started falling apart. So these replacement guys, he's gonna go nuts. They actually sell a five pack of these so you can get all these different colors if you want. And certainly these aren't gonna last a lifetime but they will need to be replaced every now and again. So we'll see how these hold up. And now that we have five different options, we'll see how that goes too. Maybe Chiggy can pick one. Say you want one of those ones? Do you want the orange one again? Okay. I think I'm going to pick... Do you want this one? His nails are so sharp. I was gone for two weeks in um, the UK and Northern Ireland. So I have not trimmed their claws recently and need to do that. But for right now, we're just going to hook it on up and play a little bit. I mentioned this in the f review video that we did, but this wand toy is pieced together. There's two pieces and it's just held together by friction. So you put that end in and then it's easily collapsible. And then you can also interchange the attachments so here's that um the new worm put on there and put these away you ready to play will want play okay she's ready to play she's always ready to play cheese cheese This is a new um, product that I actually purchased myself. Most of the product reviews that we do, the products are sent to us free of charge in exchange for the review, but this one I just bought because I've wanted to test it out. So be on the lookout for an arrival video of that one. And then I'll include a link to the Pet Fit for Life's cat wand toy. Um, and then as well as the listing that they have on Amazon for the extra squiggly worms. <laughs> I know! Did you hear his little mouth? What is this thing? The meows that he did in the beginning of this video. Oh, that's kind of fun that it falls in between. Oh my god. <laughs> Um, are the meows he did when we first got this cat wand toy and we were, oh my God, oh my God, so cute. <laughs> when we were first reviewing it and um, I left it on the dining room table uh, in the box it came in, but he would knock the box off of the table and then sit on it and sit there and meow and do those little like mouse squeaks that he does when he meows. And that's when I really know he wants to play and he likes it. <laughs> what are you doing, Gal Gal? I'll include a link to this bed as well. I'm The problem that I have with this bed is that I don't know if it's safe for cats. I don't know if the glue that was used in making it is safe. And it seems to be a mass-produced item that's sold by many Amazon sellers, so I'm not sure really who the manufacturer is, so I need to get see if I can get to the bottom of that and get that answered.
Get it. Get it. I'm gonna eat you. Why are you so cute? Oh my goodness. Look at all the cuteness in the world. One and one little kitty. It's rare for me to get footage of Charlie playing kind of holds back and then if I talk too much he doesn't want to play so that's why I was quiet there. And also because doofus will get in his way. Watch this one. I don't know if he'll repeat the yep. I feel like if you give cats obstacles when playing with a cat wand toy, it improves their desire to want to play. Like how Chicky wants to keep jumping over this bed. Okay, ready? <laughs> and also, I mean, you think about it, when cats play, they're it's like, it's how they hunt. And so a little mouse or something like that would, you know, go behind things and they'd have to ambush them. So it's, it makes sense. He's got it pretty strong. I've mentioned this in other cat wand toy videos, but I will mention it again. Um, one of the things about playing with a cat is allowing them to catch it every now and again and feel the reward of catching them. I usually hit mine on their body too, which as long as it's not, you know, it's just a, a slight tap. It's different than like whacking them with it. Charlie has been whacked a couple times with a cat wand toy by my nephew. Um, and so there's certain wand toys that he doesn't like because of being whacked. So I try to avoid that. My nephew wasn't doing it on purpose at all. He was just really young and um, didn't have the coordination he should have. Okay, Gao Gao. You got your wormy play. Okay, Gao Gao. <laughs> Bye, guys. Thanks so much for watching. Check out the links below if you want to see the prices of all this stuff. And also, tell me if you've tried this. We did the review three or four weeks ago. Maybe some of you guys bought this and can tell me if your cats like it and if you like it. We'll see you next time.